Hi everybody, this is Pradeep. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create asset master. One asset we will create it through on-premises using the transaction code AS01. It is similar like how we used to create asset master in ACC as well as in S4 HANA. So here we are going to use SAP S4 HANA on-premise option and we will create the asset master. Second option, we will create the asset master through Fury using the application, the Fury app which uh, uh, it's a new concept is there in S4. By using the Fury app, we will create the asset master. So hope you will like it. So let's move into the SAP screen. I don't remember the uh, application, so let me search it. <coughs> Create asset. But let's add uh, the other uh, one cost center so that in cost calculation, we will add that also up to doing the allocation. So if I will take this one, then directly it will be there. Uh, let us let me take this one utility. But in future, we will do that. Let me take this one. In During AUC, we can include this one. Okay, so automatically your profit center should be there. Then specify your details. So we will calculate the depreciation for this asset also from this date. save it. Right, as it created, then now let's post one document, post acquisition. Now debit the asset, uh, sorry, credit to the vendor and uh, asset debited. So document posted. So we got the operation document and with reference to operation document, we should have the asset document will be there. So let me note the document number. It will be same already we have seen yesterday. So one more 
added here 19001 and these two documents should be there 1008 and maybe 81002 <clears throat> So in this way, we can use Fury also. Uh, another one, we can post the document. This time, let's say through Contra account, we are going to post the entry. That means with offsetting entry, if you are going to post, check that too. Post acquisition. One more option was coming that time. Okay, select your asset. If it is new asset, select new asset. If you, in, in fact, directly we can create the asset master also here. So existing asset I selected, then asset value date. Amount posted. Post it. In this case, uh, there is no use of technical clear account. Okay, so <clears throat> we can only have the asset document so that we can check. So right now, uh, multiple documents we have posted and uh, here one beautiful app is there that also we can verify. I want to see everything. Currency type, fiscal year, <clears throat> fiscal period. Still loading. Okay, still the time it will load. So let's see the doc asset explorer. So this is our asset two. In this asset two, we procured one asset 1200 and we capitalized one asset through contra account. So it is there. So right now, if I will check my asset,
So this is our asset balance and this is our GL balance. <clears throat> Eleven thousand GL balance, asset balance eight thousand five hundred and two thousand five hundred eleven thousand. So always your reconciliation account or your APC account is up to date. Okay, so this is your value machine two. So this uh, here we got the document to this one. Okay, uh, this one thirteen hundred. So in thirteen hundred document or 1009 document, no use of technical clearing account because it is not purchased. Okay, so this is the complete analysis. So we have the values asset 11K, then your asset balance after depreciation proposed depreciation again proposed depreciation after the depreciation this is our balance then number of active assets to depreciation to be posted for all uh, for this depreciation area uh, 68.6 and if i will change the depreciation area from 1 to 15 then obviously we are calculating here more depreciation. Taking too much time. Okay, so this is the data we uploaded or we through contract account we are posted so here no use of your technical clear account so technical clear account only it will be there when we are going to purchase the asset do we have a depreciation of 15 or Yeah, 15 is there. Okay, so here you can see the depreciation value is comparatively high with this depreciation. So earlier it was something, now it is 102.9.